Fora TV. The world is thinking. Psychologists have found that control is very important to people, uh, and to even to rats. Um, there's there's one really, yeah, it's funny, but there's kind of a gross study where they take a rat and they throw it into a into a bowl of water, and um, and um, it it flails around for a while um, now. To, to see if it can survive, right? And they, they measure how long it flails around before it just gives up and sinks. And um, this, these were done in the 50s. I don't know if ethics committees would allow them to do that anymore. <laughs> that sounds awful. And now I, but now I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm blanking out on, the, on, on, on what they did, but they, in one, one version, they gave the rat some control over, where, over, over what it was doing, so it, it felt it had more of a chance, and it, it, it fought much longer. And the, the version for people is uh, people in nursing homes. Um, they did a study of... Of, of very very old people in nursing homes, and 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 usually they don't have much control over their environment, so they, everything is done for them and arranged for them. And they took one group and gave them extra special control. They let them uh, pick out furniture, have it arranged how they wanted. They took care of plants and did various other things. Uh, and this one was done in I think in the late 60s or the early 70s, and the the patients who had control over their environment lived a lot longer um, on average than the ones who didn't have control. Mm -hmm. And the the need for control is not it's, it's, it's subtle and it's 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 much deeper than your conscious uh, your conscious thought processes. Uh, and there's a lot of studies that show show how that works. For instance, um, they took Yale students, a, a bunch of Yale students, and they and, and these are you know smart students. You know, even though we had there was there was exceptions to that too. And he's not president <laughs> anymore, so we we can <laughs> we can get past that. But but. Um, they didn't make them swim for their lives. They didn't make them. No, no, yeah, no. Well, I guess they try to make others, the Yale students, swim for their lives, don't they? But, but, but um, um, they they have them guessing coin tosses, and these Yale students know enough that it's they can't control the coin or, or predict how it's going to how how it's going to work. But um, but they would arrange. They, they would um, actually arrange that each student actually had a, an identical sequence of successes and failures as they guessed because the psychologists always cheat in these, uh, in these things. Yeah, if you ever, I mean, you're going to be a horrible um, subject now, but if you ever ask to a test, they don't tell you really what it's about. They don't really tell you what you're doing. They're totally lying about everything they say. And that's how they really get at the answers because they don't want you to be prejudiced. So, they, so these people had no idea that these students that they were taking a test about randomness or perception of randomness, but... So they were flipping these coins and guessing, and they were told, you're right, you're wrong, you're right, you're wrong. And then afterwards, they gave them some questions to, you know, about what just happened. And they couldn't just ask them, you know, can you control the coin? Um, or, you know, or can you foresee the future or whatever? Because uh, then they would have probably, they would have like, that would have been like a, a wake-up call. Oh, wait a minute, of course not. But they asked them slightly, very slightly more subtle questions, like, would you um, have done worse if you were distracted? Or would you do better with practice? And strangely, this, is hard, I mean, this should be hard to believe. It was hard for me to believe, but they, they said, the answer, they, a significant number said yes to those questions. And I said, ah, oh, that couldn't be. So I read other studies, and there's just a, a number of studies like that. They're just like, uh, they're amazing to read.